Hello and welcome. My name is Manny. Today we're going to give you an introduction to universal mobile apps. Well, first thing I always get asked is what is a universal mobile app? Well, it's a way for you to not only get an app for Apple and Android devices, so you get an app that you can download through their respective app stores, but you also get a mobile website and a desktop and laptop version. So no matter what type of device that you are on, you can still access your mobile app. Now, what I want to do today is go over a highlight of some of the features that we have in our platform, along with showing you exactly how you can edit and update a mobile app. So let's go through some of the features here. These are some of our top features that are in our platform. The first thing you see here is our blog integration. So we can integrate your blog right online. Business information. So you can put contact information, info about your business. Very simple to utilize. Contact information. So they can click to call, click to email, click to go to your website, click to get driving directions. Custom appearance. So you get a nice mobile layout. Fan wall feature where people can interact through multiple social media platforms custom email forms for lead generation, event listings to highlight any events that you may be doing, email photo for users to be able to share photos directly with you, loyalty card features so you can re focus on repeat business and incentivize them for it, food ordering so you can become an online ordering company if you have takeout, things like that, GPS directions to get driving directions to your location, GPS coupons where you can get coupons just for them coming to your location. They can get pop up right by just by checking in. Mobile reservations where users can actually reserve uh, services for you and actually pay for those online. Messages where all of your text messages will be stored in so they can actually get access to a lot of your content on the go. Membership feature, users have a login and password. Mailing list to get uh, opt-ins for your MailChimp and things like that. A notepad feature for them to be able to take notes and date and timestamp. News feature to, for, for them to be able to uh, see articles based on topic or keywords. One touch calling is click to call. The news feed stream, which is a little ticker at the bottom of your app that can highlight those articles and Twitter feeds. Push notifications, which are text alerts that can go right into your app. Podcast feature where they can actually get integrations through your podcast right online. A QR coupons feature that allows you to use QR codes to offer coupons and incentives. Points of interest to highlight different uh, locations on a map and list them out as well. A tell a friend feature where you can uh, you can send your they can share your app by email, by Facebook, by Twitter, Google Plus, or even text your app to their friend uh, or business contact. A real estate feature is a really cool feature for real estate agents to highlight listings that they may have and be able to showcase those by square footage, bedrooms, lot size, how many bathrooms, really gives you the ability to highlight a lot of different things for agents and brokers. A sports stats feature, uh, what that feature does is allow you to tally um, your customers, uh, tally, uh, you know, if you have any games or stuff like that that you wanna put and highlight uh, inside of your app. Uh, social feature. This feature is pretty cool because it allows the users to see how many times they've interacted with your app, how many messages messages they've seen, how many times they've interacted by posting to your fan wall, how many times they've shared your app. And on the admin side, on your side, it would allow you to see who is your most active users. So this way you can highlight, you know, different uh, things within your, your users and interact with them and do shout outs. Pretty cool feature on that end. Uh, the walkthrough tab allows you to give a step-by-step -step walkthrough of what your app does, how it functions, what kind of features it has. The voice recording features allows you to record audio, save notes, and be able to share those directly with you. Video integration allows you to integrate any type of videos that you have online, whether it be YouTube or Vimeo or anything like that, and be able to even live stream videos through the app as well. Uh, tip calculator is obviously a way for you to calculate tips. We also have other calculators like mortgage calculators as well. Below here is a couple of the integrations that we offer. As you can see, we offer a lot of different ways to integrate uh, outside third-party applications right inside of your app. So you can take a look at some of those. We'll be able to share those with you as well uh, if you want to get a more in-depth look at the integrations that we offer. So you can see here we do Shopify, Instagram, social media, Magento, OpenTable, MailChimp, LinkedIn, even MySpace. You know, I don't know how many people still use MySpace, but we do integrate with them as well. Uh, we've got shopping cart integrations. We've got uh, SoundCloud integrations, YouTube integrations, 
Woo foods. There's a lot of different things that you could integrate right through our mobile app. Okay. So next thing that I want to show you the inside of our platform. So once you get set up with your username and password, you would go to my.universalmobileapps.net to be able to log in. You put in your username and password, brings you right into our dashboard. So the dashboard is going to give you a lot of different things that you can take a look at. Uh, first thing you'll see is functionality, content, appearance, and publish, these major tabs here at the top. The functionality section gives you the ability to add delete features, to customize the name and icons of those features. And here, how, here I'll show you how simple it is to add features into your app. There's no coding experience required. You click on add new tab. You name this tab. You choose the tab function, what you want that tab to be able to do. You can see we have over 40 unique features that you can add into your, your app at any one time. There's no limit. Uh, you can either upload your own custom icon or choose from the dozens that we have here that you could just click and, and choose from. Okay. Once you've added enough features, you can edit those features in the content section. And again, no coding experience required. You just go in here, fill in the blanks and save changes. And now you've got uh, editable features right inside of your app. The appearance tab is going to allow you to update your appearance of your mobile app, whether it be the layout, the functionality, the design, the background images, all of that is integrated right here. And as you can see, you get a nice preview in real time of how that app is going to look and function. You also have a preview tab here on the right side. They can take a look at the mobile website or the mobile app version of your app and you can refresh by clicking this button right here in that circle and be able to see exactly how your app is going to look live as you can see it uh, translates or not translates but moves to the next image because if you have sliding images which are part of the background image area you can see how those will look and function and then the next section here is the publish tab this allows you to show you how your app is going to look on the app stores what the app name will be the app keywords the app icon everything description, contact information, type of app, all that fun stuff. So that is under the dashboard tab that's shown here right next to the universal mobile apps. Messages, this is where you'll be able to send out your text messages. You have unlimited text alerts free with your universal mobile app with a 98% open rate. You have the ability to send your message just to iPhone users, just to Apple users, or to both. You can also specify by location if you only want to show your message to localized audiences or to everybody across the world. You also have the ability to link content where you can say, I want this message to highlight a feature in my app, or I want the message to highlight an outside URL. Maybe you're promoting a website, maybe you're promoting a YouTube video, whatever it is that you want to highlight. And then publish allows you to send that message instantly or even schedule that message for a later date. The analytics tab is going to give you the ability to highlight uh, or actually view your analytics. So it's going to show you how many users you have, how many times um, somebody has opened up an app feature, what is your most used app feature, where are your users coming from, how are they finding you. All of that is tracked and managed there. Uh, help desk is going to give you the ability to highlight um, you know, where... Um, how to access certain features, how to you know, use content, how to um, update your app, all that will be listed there. We also have a YouTube channel where there's a bunch of videos that you can check out of walkthroughs of how to update and manage your app as well. And anytime we have new features, we create a, a YouTube video, put that right in there and uh, let you know about those as well. So definitely get in contact there if you need to. Account. Uh, features or account tab is going to give you the ability to update your password, your contact information, all that stuff inside of the app. And then QR codes is where you're going to be able to highlight marketing materials. So this will give you the ability to um, get QR codes for promotional materials, JavaScript code in case you wanted to get users to download your app right from your website. So if users come to your website from a mobile device, they will automatically get redirected to your mobile app. So that is a quick rundown of the Universal Mobile Apps platform. As you can see, we have a lot of great features, a lot of easy ways to update and create your mobile app. So if you have any questions whatsoever, feel free to get in contact with us directly. And I look forward to seeing you on our next video. Have a great day.